Oh hi! Shiny Star here. If you enjoy my content, please make sure to click the like button and subscribe to my channel. Any support is greatly appreciated. Now on to the video. Enjoy! Oh hi, and welcome back to Mr. Saito. This is episode... 4? And we have three more Minamori to get before we can go in through this door. So Brandon can see his gemstone caverns. So get on going. I can't I don't remember I don't even remember where we left. Um I think did we get this? Okay, we got the blue blue stone key, so here's our next minimory. Yeah, we only got two more. So what do you guys think of the game so far? I think it's really cute. <laughs> and... Very short, like they said it would be. But, um... I don't know, I still really like it. <laughs> oh my gosh! Mr. Saito! Are you okay? That's my boss. I skipped out on work. <laughs> what is he doing here? You want me to throw something at him? What? No, he's my boss. Are you trying to get me fired, Brandon? Okay, just making sure. Saito, is that you? Oh no. Saito, I need your help. <clears throat> I guess I gotta go help him. I'll explain my situation. Yes, sir. How do you like that I skipped out on work? Sir, I have no excuse for not being at the office today. I will work. Saito, please. Buy my golf balls. What? I'm in such a pickle. You see, I took the new clients to play golf today. Everything was going quite well until... Sir? Come closer. I don't want to say this too loudly. Yes, sir. I... I got a hole in one during today's golf game. Sorry, to you cannot tell anyone about this. I. Who'd you do? I don't have hole in one golf insurance. Oh no! What's hole in one golf insurance? It is this your small pink son? No, sir. Hole in one golf insurance is very important. In golf, a hole in one is very lucky, so you're expected to buy your friends and colleagues lots of gifts if you get one. Expensive gifts. I see. Like bars of gold. Precisely. <laughs> the clients saw my fantastic swing, but before they could confirm the results, I gathered all the golf balls on the green, threw them into a <laughs> ravine. ...and told the clients that a bear had eaten them. I came down here to dispose of the evidence, but these Minamori... ...they're playing tricks on me. They hid my golf balls and surrounded me with... ...stone statue versions of the themselves. You have to help me, Saito and small pink son of Saito. I told you he's not my son. Look at two golf balls and push them into that bottomless pit over there. As you can see, I assembled a nice ramp using train tracks that were given to me by my clients. <laughs> They're top quality train tracks, Aito. I see. 
find two golf balls and pull and push them off my train track ramp into the bottomless pit. If you do, I'll give you this lovely relic I found here. It's some sort of red stone key. Yes, sir. I must have be so talented. Uh, you gotta think like... A minimory. I was gonna say, think like a Saito, but that's not it. Also, how does he know this pit is bottomless? It's not like he went down there himself. Ball one. Oof. Ball nine. Oh, I have two. Like, why is there so many Minamori if you only got two balls, but... I only need two of them. Who did you guys like both? I like mini golf, but that's it. I don't. Regular golf is boring. I'm sorry. <laughs> it sucks that in this universe, a hole in one kind of sucks. <laughs> so you have to spend lots of money on it. <laughs> Fantastic work, Saito. As promised, here is a relic I found here while I was golfing. Stone key. It's a good thing you somehow knew that you needed to be here to help your boss. Good proactive decision making, Saito. Doesn't even matter that I skipped my presentation. <laughs> and I believe the red thing is over here. Uh, over even farther. <laughs> right here. And onion. Well, well, what do we have here? Some adventures, perhaps. Come rest your feet and have some tea. Thank you for knowing that my feet are tired. Is it okay, Mr. Saito? Can we rest here for a bit? Do you know her? Not personally, but she's an Aunt Onion. Aunt Onions are always nice. Okay, sure. What brings you two here today? We're trying to find the flooded gemstone caverns. If we carry enough Minamori back to their meeting ground, the door to the caverns will open. So we think. <laughs> well, isn't that exciting? You two must be very strong. Well, only one of us. Mr. Saito is very strong. He even ca carried a Megamori. <laughs> so this llama worm is helping you? He's so nice. He's skipping work today to help me fulfill my dream. And I know that means a lot, because he has a really important job. He works for Saito Court making buttons for the underground tunnels. Oh, isn't that just wonderful, dear? What a nice young man. He thinks I have an important job? Aww. Would you both like a cup of tea? Yes, I like tea. I like my tea with milk. <laughs> yes, please. Thank you. Alright then. Help yourself to some cookies, too. Most buds your age wouldn't want to have tea with an old Aunt Onion like me. Oh, most of my friends are senior citizens, because he works at the... Or his grandma works at the... Uh... Old folks home. They are? Well, that's interesting. Why is that? Well, my grandma is kind of a young grandma, so she has to work. She cooks food in old folks' homes, so sometimes I get to go there and hang out with everyone. <laughs> we talk and watch TV together. Sometimes we play cards. But I gotta be careful with that. Some grandpas there get really upset about losing, so I try to let them win. That's very big of you. You don't mind losing? Not at all. 
I think the whole reason to play games is to have fun, so I don't mind losing if it means everyone can have fun. What kind of kid is this? A very nice one. Letting adults win so their feelings aren't hurt? That seems backwards. Really, the only thing I don't like about having mostly senior citizen friends is learning how to say goodbye. <laughs> Saying goodbye is never easy. Grandma says I have a lot of practice for someone my age. Yeah, that's... Uh, that's okay. Because I believe they're in a better place. And someday, I'll get to see them again. Thank you for the tea and cookies. Of course, thanks for sitting with an old Aunt Onion for a little while. Now, before you go, help yourselves to what's in that treasure chest over there. Maybe it'll help you on your adventure. I hope we'll meet again someday. We will. What's in here? Oh boy. The hunks of tree trunk chunks. <laughs> Just try saying that three times fast. So now I'm gonna go to the store and get hand sanitizer wipes. To feed the <sighs> Gigamori or whatever. Hmm. Okay, let's go. Can I introduce you? Yes, you can. Yes, you can. That smell. Do you have the decaying hunks of tree trunk chunks on your person? Maybe we do. Does that sweeten the deal? Oh, yes, I would gladly trade you <laughs> my hand sanitizer wipes for such a delicacy. No money required. It's a deal. Yeah, let's go back. <laughs> I can't imagine any living thing, even as fictional as these, to want to eat hand sanitizer wipes. That, that, the feeling, the thought of it just burns my mouth. Ugh. Hand sanitizer wipes, these are my favorite. Bye. <laughs> Hey, we have a leak now. Let's go get the uh, Metamori. Stay away, sweet prince. Wait, no, we need that Metamori. Don't, don't worry, I'm sure he's right over here. So. Hmm. I just wonder where our friends went. <laughs> Did they make it out? <laughs> Before we lifted the Gigamori. I'm so proud of you, Mr. Saito. And for the trip back. Again. Hmm. This is the last. Oh, yeah. Yes. Uh, I can't believe you found six Minamori. You guys are amazing. Mr. Saito was incredible. You should have seen him. I did see him. He is, is incredible. Thank you. He belongs in the museum. What? I'm just not sure how we're gonna get the, that last one. Hmm. Uh, hello. 
Where'd you come from? Dirt. Did I hear you're looking for Minamori? Yes, we are. Check the Kinoko Matsuri Club. There's one in there right now. Man, how are we gonna get them to let us in? Why don't you wear disguise or something? Ooh, that's a great idea. Oh my gosh, I could dress up as little buds. You do look a lot like him. Thank you so much. If you were dressed as little buds, they'd let you in for sure. I just had to find some sunglasses. I think I saw some sunglasses at the Saito accessory store. Is that the place next to Saito Mart in the train station? Yes. Woo. Come on, let's go get your disguise. Let's go. <laughs> Wait. Wait. I had to see something. <laughs> um. the same dude, but... That's not... I wonder, like... Why... Why'd she put this in here? But there's... There's nothing that you can do there. <laughs> so I, I... I mean, this game's been out for a while. I don't think there's gonna be any DLC or anything, but... I guess we'll see. <laughs> Anyway, let's go to the accessory place. A risky... A risk-taking indoor plant. Hey. Um. A risk... A verse indoor plant. Look at the sunglasses. There that... Some sky buds actually eat roses. Oh, I didn't mean to click on the rose, sorry. Appearance of sunglasses. Uh, a Rubik's Cube. How can you do that without your hands? I mean, you guys don't have hands. And look, it's a blue feather. You know, from Harvest Moon and all that. Welcome to Saito Accessories, the accessory store for Saitos. Please feel free to browse our high-quality products. I'm interested in high-quality products. Thank God, I love Brandon. Do you have to buy them with money? Um, yes, of course. That's too bad. You know, I myself am in the accessory business. I make friendship bracelets. See this pattern? I made it up last week. I think it looks very stylish. Ooh, that is stylish. The colors are actually inspired by labels. That's why I decided to use pink and lavender string. Ooh, I really like that one. I actually have a client that likes labels crafts. Is that so? Would you by chance be willing to trade a bracelet for, say, some sunglasses? <laughs> that pair of sunglasses over there? I think I'd be willing to make that trade. Fantastic. Here's one legal friendship bracelet and... Hmm. Say, would you be willing to trade another friendship bracelet for that purple tie over there? The one with all the desserts on it. Hmm. Yes, I think I got to do that. Great, it's a deal. Here are your bracelets, courtesy of Cave Bud Crest. Tell your friends. Enjoy. Thank you. Feel free to help yourself to your new accessories. Hi, Mr. Saito. I negotiated. Very entrepreneurial of you. Does that mean you can get 
Oh, sunglasses now? Yes, and you can get that purple dessert tie that you like so much. What tie? You're funny, Mr. Saito. I traded a friendship blaze bracelet for it. That, the tie is yours now. I cannot speak today. You should try it on. Oh boy, let's try. Well, go on. Well, let's see it. I look fancy. Whoa, so cool. You look great. This tie has donuts and slices of cake on it, just like Vitatou's cakes. I traded him with his little handmade bracelet so I could have this tie. What a nice thing to do. <laughs> Are you okay, Mr. Saito? Come on, Brandon. Go put on your new sunglasses. Yeah, I guess I gotta go. Get him. Brandon transforms into... Old Buds. Let's go to Kanoko Mitsuri Club. So let's... let's get her... make our way there. I look so snazzy with my new tie. Hi, guys. <laughs> hey there, where do you think you're going? Yo. Oh, buds? Who did you think I was? Some kind of hooligan? No, not at all. We just... Didn't see you at first. Our sincerest apologies. Apologies accepted. Now, if you'll excuse me. But of course, please go right in. Wait. Who's that with you? We don't have a llama worm on our guest list. Uh, uh. He's our backup dancer. I see. Alright, then go on in and have a good show. Good job, Brandon. I really love this tie. Oh my gosh, I can't believe we're actually here. Is that the music group that you like? No holds on... Uh, no holds barred. I am so happy that my glasses fell off. Okay, they're back on again. <laughs> Mr. Saito, look! It's the final Minamori! Uh, uh, by Minamori, I actually mean Gigamori. Gigamori. Is it gonna be okay, Mr. Saito? I guess we'll find out. In the next episode. Probably the last episode of Mr. Saito. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!